explain you how to cut a uh, tight frock or gown uh, sleeveless without sleeves okay you think you think this is your fabric okay uh, today I use a 30 36 inches wide length of the width of your fabric okay 36 inches then uh, there are two selvages here okay you should cut uh, you should buy uh, two and uh, half yard okay uh, is equal to 90 uh, 90 inches the length of the garment at two inches and uh, cut like this okay your length and uh, at two inches okay I I'll cut again middle of the fabric then same length then then two inches okay this one for back part this is your uh, good side this is for back part uh, for opening with zipper I measure one inch okay for back part this is for uh, front part all again this is the downside okay uh, then fit like this this is the fall side front side back side this is open side uh, I'll clean like this. Okay. Now I'm going to draw back and front at the same time. Okay. Okay, I will use like this. Fall side, front part, back side. There are two layers here. First of all, I draw a horizontal line like this. Uh, for this garment, uh, shoulder length uh, 15 inches, divide by 2, uh, 7 and half inches. Uh, I mark, I measure like this, 7 and half inches, okay. Uh, shoulder slope, 1 and half inches, okay. I measure like this to down from this point one two three uh, for this garment next circumference uh, 14 uh, 15 inches divided by 4 is equal to 3 and uh, 3 quarters uh, minus half an inch is equal to 3 and 1 quarters let me show like this from number one now I'm going to draw uh, back neckline, high neck. Uh, you can measure uh, the def depth of the back uh, neckline, half inch or one inch or one and a half or two, in, in two inches. Okay, I measure two inches. Uh, this is my guidelines. You draw your neck like this don't you draw like this this one better now I'm going to draw a front arm a front neckline deep neckline uh, you can measure uh, six or six and a half 
I measured 6 inches I draw line again 2 inches I draw like this round leg line uh, this is the middle of the line okay I draw like this start from this line and touching the line and can you understand okay you should touch this line don't draw like this if you like you can this is not the round neckline this is the, this is v shape this one v shape and this one round neckline okay both are correct then uh, now i'm going to draw uh, armhole uh, i mark number four i connect number three and number four this is my shoulder line uh, one to two measurement is equal to seven and a half inches i measure two down for my armhole length same length one to two uh, seven and a half inches This is my armhole line. I'll again measure 1 to 2 measurement. 1 to 2 measurement is equal to uh, 7 and a half inches. Again, I measure uh, number 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I connect number 3 and number 8. <coughs> and uh, middle of the middle of that line, this line. I mark number nine. You should measure uh, half inch, half an inch to this side towards into uh, like this. I mark number ten. I connect number three and number ten. Okay. I measure two inches like this from a mall line. Like this. Now I'm going to draw front armhole line, armhole curve through number 12, 12, 2 inches. And again, I am going to draw back armhole. I measure 1 inch. 1 inch I draw like this now I'm going to measure the front armhole and back armhole they should be same but not same then I extend like this now same both curves length okay this is back shoulder line new one back shoulder this is for front part this one for back part okay this is a sleeveless this is a sleeveless rock then you should measure half <coughs> half inch and you cut off like this both armhole this is your new armhole like for back one for front one okay you should be for sleeveless if you like mm, uh, you can change this measurement like this if you like okay and now i'm going to draw uh, waistline uh, hps mean high point of shoulder uh, same to number four here <coughs> from number four i measure to down side uh, 
15 inches and hip match uh, to, to the hip from HPS from number 4 uh, 22 inches okay this is your hemline this is uh, hip line this is waist line uh, for this garment uh, waist measurement waist circumference 28 inches divide by 4 7 inches uh, if you like you can add uh, for easy or uh, be because uh, if you like uh, because of uh, this is uh, this these are cotton pure cotton uh, fabrics uh, there are there is uh, for each you should know if you uh, otherwise you should uh, for wash okay uh, I measure uh, 28 divided by 4 is equal to 7 inches uh, 7 inches I add uh, quarter inch okay and then uh, 7 and quarter inch like this quarter inch for uh, not a loose I told you there is for each okay uh, for if measurement uh, 14 inches uh, sorry not 14 not 14 14 inches 14 inches divided by uh, 4 is equal to 10 inches you should uh, add cottage because of we added cottage here you do the same for hip line okay and then uh, uh, quarter, uh, sorry uh, 14 inches divided by 4 uh, and at cottage 10 and cottage okay you are uh, hem with also uh, same measurement Bust circumference for this garment uh, 35 inches divided by 4, 8 and 3 quarters at 1 inch, 9 and 3 quarters. You should curve like this it's a nice curve and middle of the line 0 0.1 18 like this okay nice curve uh, for this garment uh, if you uh, if you can if you like to tie it here uh, I measure uh, for this garment but HPS to bust point, bust level, nine and a half inches. This is bust level, and this is bust line. This is this one uh, armhole line. This one bust line. Okay, bust circumference uh, thirty five inches divided by uh, four. Uh, Divide by four, eight and three quarters. There is a loose here, easy loose. Okay, this is your uh, this is your uh, body measurement. If you if you uh, if you saw for sale, if you sell. Uh, you should cut from this line add in sewing seam allowance okay this one for sale for your measurement there is a loose here if you want you can measure under bust level under bust level uh, from waistline to uh, three three uh, inches or two and a half inches this is your under bust level from this line 
I measure from this line to upwards. This is your underbust level. You also measure underbust level uh, circumference. Uh, sorry, underbust circumference divided by 4 like this. Then you can tie to your garment like this. If you like this one for sale. Okay, this one for your body measurement. Now I'm going to cut me. One inch for side seam. So in allowance, one inch. A half inch for back armhole. Uh, back armhole, this one. Okay. Back shoulder line, this one, red one. Not faint enough. Quarter inch enough for, uh, quarter inch enough for back neck line. Okay. I'll cut, adding quarter inch like this. There are two parts for the portion. Okay. I kept it. Uh, I kept it uh, aside. Okay. And now I'm going to cut my uh, front part. This is the new front armhole. This one, red one. Okay. I'll cut in, add in half inch and this one, blue one for front shoulder line. I cut, add in half inch. This one round neckline, quarter inch enough. Okay. Okay, this is my, uh, this, this is this is my front part. Uh, how to sew it? How to sew it? I'm going to cut the casing. You should uh, use uh, another color. I'll draw, uh, this is a fall side. I'll draw neckline, shoulder line, and armhole line, and side two inches enough. Okay, two inches enough. I measure one inch and I'll draw a line like this again okay you should cut uh, along this uh, line okay. from the line From the line, you cut from the line. This is your uh, wrong side. This is your wrong side. This is your front uh, good side. <coughs> Keep like this and measure sorry and so uh, quarter inch for neckline don't so shoulder line uh, so again so again uh, armhole uh, for half an inch and side seam for one inch okay sides one inch uh, and a cut off quarter inch from armhole both armholes and uh, you should know to cut like 
this okay. and uh, again turn for your right side okay and one last side okay now finish our neckline and armhole line okay for front part for back part This is your uh, waistline. This area for your zipper. You zip, okay? You should uh, sew this area, no? You know? This area. Then, after sewing, this is whole side. This on whole side. You draw neckline, shoulder line, armhole line, and side seam two inches in the okay? If you like one inch. If you like, uh, can this line or this line, okay? Now I'm going to cut from this line, okay? I like, sorry, I like this side. So that part. This is my back part after sewing this area. This is back part, okay? Okay, uh, wish you a happy new year, my dear, okay?